Hello everyone, I'm Rob Smith of Smith of the Black with a Strat Time Report, and things are starting to deteriorate here just a bit. Spy looking like a going outside day here, so poked up in the morning and then collapsed back through. Uh, so 452.26 would give you the outside day. So we'll see. Uh, still an inside week. Uh, however, still closer to taking that week down. So that's really what we're going to be focused on. If you get that 2-2 reversal in the week, then you'd have a little bit, a lot more trouble. So SPY coming down here, if we go to our 60, had that outside 60, then the 2 down, and then another 2 down to accelerate a little bit. But uh, basically it was the Q's. Q's having problems, all sorts of trouble, and we'll get to that in a second. But still inside on the week, and they're trying to hold on to an inside day. But now, here's where the Q's go into trouble here. Two up on two down reversal on Tuesday, so the Q's gonna stay in trouble below 360.244 here, right? So we want to know about that level as long as they're below that, you got potential problems, right? And it just did this on the 30. So once it does that, to do this here, the inside 30 right there, two one two down now we just flip we got a new 60 so we'll see if they want to keep the heat on or not uh, if we go to the Dow Jones diamonds Dow Jones diamonds a little stronger but back into the range again on the day still an inside week still handling an inside month uh, and just on the 60 just got this here the outside bar inside bar three one two down so starting to lose them as well coming out gangbusters it's the start was the small cappers and the small cappers poked up, and now we're an outside day here, right? Getting a little closer, and this would be a 2-2 reversal in the week if they can take this out. 2-0-3-0-3. So you got a little bit of distance on that, but you can see it poked up early. There's your 3-1, 2 down on the 60, right? So we'll see if that uh, continues. Takes care of business, as you can see this. It's not only just an outside bar of that. It's an outside bar of all these three days. So still in trouble if it stays below this. 20501 so we'll be aware of that because we got a new 60 starting here and a lot of things in trouble if there's anything uh you know that i like to look at is the tr the gappers and if you look at sst and you go down to the 30 you'll see this two up two up by taking out the highs and boom two two reversal back to the downside here below 2261 and then when it goes down to here I'm sorry that's below 2735 no higher high but then you get your 212 back up and you can cover and go long 212 inside back up over 22 and there's a quick buck in what three minutes right so real nice stuff there amr was on the gapper list here and you're going to see this still an inside day so we were aware of that but you gap intraday gap and you had the two up 2260 reversal right there below 123.78 trading 119.31 and still no higher high over there um, if we got anything they're going staying with that defensive posture on the upside utes and there's once again the three one two day but the magnitude is just to take that out which it did so utes are stalling out a little bit here but uh, you know that's what they're doing so far uh, because we've seen like xlp here also the two down two up on a tuesday and if that works now you got your 2-2 reversal month. Two down, two up for the XLP. Stalls out into here on the 60, but would be rev strat 1-2. If it can t come back up and leading over there, you got Procter & Gamble. And Procter & Gamble here, the 3 outside, 2-2. Two, two. So when it takes this out, because this is an outside bar, we're looking for these two to become an outside bar of that, which we did. And causing the outside weak, if that works, Potentially you get the two down, two up month. It looks like it poked up a little bit above it. But on the month, over 156.47. It looks like it was up there and backed off. So we'll see. You got all month. Uh, if we go to uh, more defensive stuff, towers, AMT. American Tower coming up. And that's an inside month to the upside after last week's 2-2 two, two reversal week. So that's good all month. And that tells you look at CCI. CCI just taking that out. So having a nice little day in the SBAC tower. SBAC, good. So this thing's uh, doing fairly well here. Market's still staying heavy, though. XLV was also having a nice little day. XLV. So you got your outside there and just kind of stalls out there on the XLV. So we'll see. There's like Johnny John 
staying positive, and that's a 2-2 on a Tuesday, but now backing off. Beck Dickinson, BDX, 2-2 on a Tuesday, 2 down, 2 up. Magnitude was to take that out, which it did. Now it goes inside on the 60, we'll see. Still an inside month, but uh, we'll see how that goes. If we go to VRTX, and VRTX having a nice little day. Backing off just a tad, but this is on the macro list. This is a 2 2 reversal year, right? And you can see it's already having a nice little week. What we look for on a Tuesday is anything that was bought on Monday and then bought again on Tuesday or those 2 2 reversals. Market's still heavy here, folks. So just a few more on the long side here because it's fun to say ding dong, DDL, 2 2 reversal month. Two down, two up, and a nice little two days here. Now, potential, the rev stretch, 60 back up over this thing. Over 610, you're kind of sitting right there, we'll see. But, like I said, Q's heavy. And if we get over there, it was the SMHers right out the chute. And we saw that right away. SMH, inside day and down. All right? And if that works, you had an outside week. Potential, the 3-2 down, which you have. Which means this buying was being rejected, and they're still rejecting it stalled out on a Monday, and then boom, down she goes, and that's pretty much everybody, you got AVGO here, two up, two down on a Tuesday, and the reason that's important is because it changes that continuity of the opening, you see that, here, and if that works, changes that continuity in the week, it was green on the week until today, boom, change it, and if that works, you go 2-2 two -two reversal on the week to the downside below 6-15-78, you're there now, if you go to AMAT, AMAT, inside day to the downside. So it's a simultaneous break. Almost every semiconductor is a two down on the day, right? And you had that outside week here, still rejecting that. Getting closer to taking out the month. If you go to microchip, and microchip here, inside day to the downside. And if that works, here's your 3 2 shooter counters hammer down on the week. Still handily inside in the month because it's early in the month. You go to Cirrus Logic. Inside day to the downside. Down she goes. And if that works, that was a two up week, and that's a two two reversal week. Looking to take these guys out down in here. 7884. So you got a little bit more room on that. If you go to LRCX, and LRCX inside day to the downside three two weaker you can see the similarity here and now an inside 60 we'll see if they can try and firm up you've got nvidia coming down that was a slight higher high yesterday so that's a two two reversal on a tuesday and if that works sets up the two two reversal week here below 262 67 you're there uh, if we go to lite boom too weak to stay inside yesterday. They sold it on a Monday and came back on a Tuesday. And if that works, 2-2 two, two reversal week. 2 up, 2 down here. Below 95.22. Handily so. Um, MU. Inside day to the downside. And if that works, you can go after that 3-2 week over here. Still an inside month. Market firming up just a tad here. So we'll see how that goes because we're looking at Intel. It's still an inside day. All right, and if you go to AMD, looks like that might be poking down. But if you get those two to help out, we might get some more good puke in here in the afternoon. So we can keep an eye on those guys to see if that keeps going. Uh, if we go to D-Dog, and D-Dog going outside week here on a 2-2 on a Tuesday, two up. Boom, back to a previous range, pivot machine gun style on all these guys. So D-Dog having some issues here and just looking for that outside week. If we go to BABA, China names having some issues here. And BABA, another inside day to the downside here. And if that works, potentially the inside week to the downside. And that would kick in below 108.71. If we go to UPST. UPST. We know we had that outside month last month. And here's the inside week below here, if you can break this. Below 10108. Alright? And so here, once again, two up, two down on a Tuesday. 
It was green on the week as, as of yesterday, but you come in today and you change that on a 2-2 reversal, you got all sorts of trouble going on. If we go to NVAX, and NVAX to up to down on a Tuesday and getting annihilated here below 73.49, all right? And the good thing about all this stuff, none of this stuff gapped. It opened inside and then broke these two twos, right? That's important. Uh, if we go to Coinbase, Coinbase, slight two up, two two on a Tuesday, boom, down she goes. And if that works, sets this up, the two two reversal, two up, two down on the week, below 184.38. Nice little move you got there. All right, if we go to TWLO, and TWLO, two up, two down on a Tuesday, right? And then you've got your inside 60 right here to get you in, right? Coming back through all these guys. If we go to Alcoa, we're losing some of the inflation guys here today. Alcoa, big outside bar there. So not sure how much more you get out of that unless you can go take out that week. But uh, just a you know, appointment of note so you can go and look like SCCO, Copper, how you doing, buddy? SCCO. Two up, two down, and you can see on this one, the continuity was already red on the week. It was a two up by taking out these highs, but the continuity is already down, right? It was already red. So there's your two up, two down, and looking to come down and take out these guys and give us the outside week over here. If we go to some of these truckers, ODFL and ODFL just having all sorts of trouble here inside month to the downside and the trannies after this the inside week 212 bam down she goes uh, JB Hunt was also having some problems over there uh, as well and you can see this I don't think this was quite inside of the month but you got that two up two two reversal on the monthly basis and here you can see your broadening formation clear as day on the weekly and this is what you look for the two one two pivot machine gun take all these guys out. So the question would be weak enough to get down into this stuff because this was an outside bar as well on the month, right? So that's that's the further broadening formation all the way down there. I think XPO was having some problems as well. XPO not as much on the monthly, but you are taking out last week's. And you always like to look at any groups or subgroups that are all uh, working together. If we go to Boeing, Boeing, RevStrat week, one, two, two to the downside for the week Boeing in trouble below 184.47 all right so you want to be aware of that if we go to Splunk and Splunk here gives us the outside week on the slight higher high two two on a Tuesday and down it goes to give you the outside week all right and very nice if we go to DoorDash and DoorDash to up to down on a Tuesday. All right. Very important concept to understand if you only traded one day a week. If we go to Sava, and Sava goes three day, right? And taking out last week's lows and going after last month. And if you go to the 30, you're going to see this the outside 30, inside 30, and down, and then another inside 30, and down again. All right, blood red is what you want when you're shorting, right? And there you got it. If we go to Riven and Riven was already a two down yesterday after this beautiful two two reversal here on the daily. Two up, two down, no higher high, still good. And if this works, it sets up the two two reversal week. Two up, two down below 44 you're there right now so for the rest of the week that's in trouble below 44 all right market's still a little heavy here so uh if we go to teslers teslers getting closer to an outside day all right you're still two on the week all right and you're still green on the week slightly but anytime you get something that's almost an outside bar that's something I'd want to know about because you're a lot closer to going three than anything else, potentially inside on the 30. So QQQ, the problem, mind that. And so you can see here on the 15, 
inside on the 15 now. So trying to firm up off of that, but we'll see. Uh, a lot of heavy tech out there, so be aware of that. All right, that's going to do it for today. I'm up to the Smith of the Black with Strat Time Report.